Hi everyone, it's Agent Juicy again, and I'm gonna do a video for you guys and how to get the new PBM voice for BlackBerry Messenger 7. At the beginning of this video, I want to make it really clear this only works if you have a phone that has the operating OS of OS 6, 7, or 7.1, anything above 6 basically. It does not work with OS 4, 4.2, 4.1, 5, it just only works with 6 and 7. So if you have like an older phone that does not have OS 6 or 7, uh, you won't be able to get this upgrade. Okay, so what we're gonna do is go to this website right here. You're gonna go, you're gonna look and fr from this website, you're gonna click right here, sign in. So when you click sign in now, it's gonna bring you a page that looks something like this. But what's gonna happen is you're gonna need to make a second account now for a BlackBerry Beta Zone. How do you make a BlackBerry Beta Zone account? It's gonna show up right there. Basically, it's gonna look something. It's basically fill in all the information, such as your name. I'm gonna leave the video like this on a slant so you guys don't see too much of my information. And uh, first name, last name, address, state, province, country, all the other stuff as well. Also, it's gonna leave, bring you stuff like this. I'm gonna slide back in. Which phone are you gonna be using? You don't have to fill in this stuff. Just fill in all the stuff that has a red asterisk, right? Now, secondly, what you're gonna do after you get all this stuff now is you're gonna go back now and you're gonna see illegible programs. Under illegible programs, and it's going to have my programs. You shouldn't have anything here because you now signed up for it. Under illegible programs, you're going to see uh, consumer BBM7 and consumer Facebook. You're going to select on the BBM voice, well, the BlackBerry Messenger 7.0. After you select on this now, you're going to see something looking like this. It's going to say news, check it out, blah, 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 blah. We don't read all this stuff. So we're going to click on downloads because that's what we're going to be here for be here for and look, look re read again device support only for OS 6 7 and 7.1 not 5 not 4 not 3 this is what you need to have your OS device okay so now we're gonna let's look right on the right hand side you're gonna see English and you're gonna select the download link well send the download link now what's gonna happen is when you hit this button right here well, I already downloaded this, as you guys could probably see. What's going to happen is when you select this link now on your phone, let me just put this down for a second. So, look at my phone now. On my phone itself, you're going to see, let me just zoom right in for you guys a little closer. Okay, so we're going to go to the messages on my phone, and if you scroll down, you're going to get the first message that looks something like this that says Consumer Blackberry Messenger. So you're going to click on this right here, then you're going to scroll down, and you're going to see you have to download this link, blah, 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 and this is the website. You're going to highlight this website now on your phone, copy, then go back, then what you're going to do is go straight down to your browser. In your phone browser now, you're going to hit copy, paste, hit enter. And this is going to basically go back to the same website like signing in in your BlackBerry ID for the beta zone. So when you get inside of here now, it's going to look like this. I'm sorry for the internet being so slow on my phone. So what's going to happen is uh, you're going to basically have to scroll down here and select I agree. Then you're going to hit continue, well, submit. I don't know if you guys can see this. Yeah, you're going to have to hit submit. And this is going to be loading right now. And you're going to see this pop, pop right up. So you're going to hit download. And when you're downloading now, the whole screen would pop right up here. And it's going to download. One problem that you're, you may get, what I encountered, is uh, you should go back to your app world and upgrade your blackberry id if you have not done it in a while so how do we upgrade a blackberry id i'll show it to you guys so you go to blackberry app world right inside of here and you just let it open up and then you're going to type in on your keyboard you're going to press the alt you're just going to wait for it to load okay so you're going to hit the alt button and then you're going to type in r s t so what this basically does it's going to refresh the entire of uh, BlackBerry app world for you 
and it's gonna shut down basically like it's if you typed it incorrectly it's gonna shut right down so let me show you R S T so if you look right now you see how it just like appeared and it just shut that right down okay so now we're gonna go back in and you're gonna see now update blackberry id and it's gonna update your blackberry id it's gonna reboot your entire phone after you've done that now the down that's if you encounter a problem with the download okay but if you haven't it should work perfectly fine now the moment you hit i uh submit you're gonna get a second email from blackberry this is the email that i just got you see november 15 20 something blah 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 so you're gonna see basically this stuff right here confidential this message is not intended for so by so by so blah, blah, blah. okay so this is the key code after you installed it and the phone has rebooted you're gonna click on the blackberry messenger icon then you're gonna see it come up with do you accept these terms and conditions then you're they're gonna you're gonna see right above uh, accept you're gonna see something right key code you have to copy this down so you're gonna hit the upward button copy 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 okay and for some phones you have to use this button because you don't get the copy button so hold down the center button and you're gonna see copy I don't know if you guys can see that but copy right there so you're gonna hit copy and then you're gonna go back into the blackberry the the icon the bbm icon now what i was telling you about and you're gonna copy that key code on the bbm agreement right then you're gonna paste it on there so you're gonna paste it right in there and then you're gonna hit accept and then you're gonna have to sign in with your bbm id how it looks and that's about it and it should be smooth sailing from there i wish i had another phone that i could show you guys on how exactly to do it but this is the best i could do and uh this goes out to the guy name he's been asking me to do it so his name is ed Dur to uh, this guy right here <laughs> don't want a brutal brutally murder her is the name anyway so that's how it works any questions leave it down in the section below let me read to you guys I'm gonna recap this for you guys so you're gonna go to the link on the computer you're gonna hit sign in with your BBM ID, with your Blackberry ID after you hit Blackberry ID you're gonna have to sign up for one of these accounts so under pro under profile you're gonna have to fill in all your name title all address and everything like that after you finish all that stuff you're gonna have to go back to programs right here and you're gonna see blackberry 7 uh, consumer you're gonna click downloads after you click downloads you're gonna hit send download link remember this only works for device support of that and uh, it's going to send you the first email. You go to the email, it's going to have a website in there. You go to that website, you sign in, you hit uh, the download button, I agree, basically the agreement, and uh, then you accept it. It sends you, an, uh, it's, it opens up another link on the web page for you, and on this page you're going to basically see uh, the download links and stuff like that. So you hit download. And if it stops working at any point, just go and uh, update the BBID, how I showed you. So you go to Apple, hit RST, then you're going to see it quit, and then you're going to refresh it, and then you're going to go back in, upgrade the BBID, then retry downloading. After you retry downloading now, you're going to copy the key code. So the phone's going to restart after you fully download, right? After... You, the phone restarts. You're gonna click on the uh, the. You're gonna click on the email that you got. You're gonna copy that uh, the key code. Then you're gonna take that key code and open up the BlackBerry Messenger 7.0 app. And when you open up the 7.0 app now, it's gonna ask you to agree to the agreement. And right above accept, where it says, do you want to accept this agreement or not? You're gonna see accept and decline. Right above it, you're gonna see a little thing marked key code. You're gonna put in the key code right there on the phone. Okay, and then you're gonna paste, re-sign it at your BlackBerry ID, and everything should be safe. I suggest to all of you guys that you take the a backup of your phone. The first thing you should do is like do a backup just to make sure, because this is beta version, guys. This this stuff has a lot of bugs in it, and you could lose all your contacts. I have already uh, not gotten like a couple BBM messages. Anyways, any questions? Ask me in the comment section below. Thank you.